There can only be one winner, and you're looking at it. Let's go. YouTube, this is a Hyun Lei deck. It is all about Hyun Lei. I almost don't want to call an X Saber deck because it doesn't have that many X Sabers, and I can build a full X Saber deck, which did do well in the latest meta weekly. So this is mostly a Hyun Lei wielder deck. How so? How does this work to summon Hyun Lei? Why do we care so much about her? By the way, she's one of my favorite synchros in the TCG. You guys ask me all the time, what are my favorite synchros? What are my favorite TCG cards? This is it. This is it. Especially when she's paired with Trap Stun. So I will talk about all of that in a second. Hyun Lei on summon. Select up to three spell and trap cards in the field. Destroy them. Boom. Goodbye. Gone. How do we easily use this card? Well, with Dark Soul. Dark Soul is a non-tuner X Saber, which is the only requirement to make Hyun Lei. What you do is you normal summon Dark Soul. Then with Wielder, the brand new tuner, which is so good. You're gonna be seeing this card forever. I hope so. It's gonna be probably tier zero within six months, six months to a year. We'll find a top tier deck with it or something will come out. If you control level three monster, you could special summon this card from your hand. Then you can make your instant Hyun Lei. So that's literally no warning. A Hyun Lei could come out. Yes, they could stop it with Canadian stuff, but they have to have that. That's what you're going to trap stun. Negate all other trap cards on the field. Canadia, any card that could stop the Dark Soul and Wielder, your trap stun will stop it. Now get ready for the good part. We synchro Shokan for Hyun Lei on summon. Not only do, do we destroy all of their back row, we also destroy whatever monster they have in the field if they are smaller than 2300 due to Wielder's effect. That's what Wielder does. And to make this super consistent, we have Sangin. Sangin searches for Wielder. Sangin searches for Dark Soul. Dark Soul in the end phase when sent to the graveyard also searches itself or searches for a Full Helm Knight. Full Helm Knight is just our fourth level three tuner in case we run out of juice because we are using these like crazy. If we run out of juice, we have Full Helm Knight. Full Helm Knight, if they declare an attack onto any of our monsters once while face up, negate the attack. If you destroy a monster in defense, you get to special summon a Dark Soul from the grave. Main Phase 2, Synchro Shokan! That's what I would do in the TCG, but that would be for next turn. I'm playing Hallucigenias and Kanadias for protection, get Pallias in the field for extra damage. I like Hallucigenia and Econ for anything that's too big. If there's a monster too big, we have Sihemoth, which is level six. It could banish it. We could also make a gigantic castle, or we could fall back on our Hallucigenia and Econ. Kanadia doesn't fully get the job done on a monster too big. For example, if they have a Angel Gear Reactor Dragon, flipping it down is no good. So Hallucigenia does help out a lot there. This deck is really powerful. Their back row is not safe. You trap stun, blow up everything, destroy their monster, OTKs. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. And quick pro tip, no one else will tell you this. If you and Zectron with your Wielder and your Dark Soul or your Wielder and your Sangin, well, let's just say uh, Wielder and Dark Soul, a U-Bell will miss the timing. You want to destroy a U-Bell? No summon? This is how you do it. Or, or with just Wielder and Sangin, that will cost, that will make a U-Bell miss the timing if you summon a Sahemoth. Chainlink 2 will be Wielder. But oh, wait, there's more. Hyun Lei will also cause U-Bell to miss the timing. So Hyun Lei, Wielder, miss the timing on U-Bell. And Zectron, miss the timing on U-Bell. And then Sahemoth with Sangin, miss the timing on U-Bell. That's the pro tip of the day. YouTube, I just want to quickly add, there are other synchro options. You could play Hyper Psychic Blaster. It's a little harder to summon than your Gigantic Castle. Like, you can't summon it off of your Hunt Hyun Lei. But if you have a Sahemoth, you could summon Hy uh, Hyper Psychic Blaster. Konami, please increase the extra deck size. Every synchro deck I make, there's not enough room in the synchro deck. You could also play Armades. Armades with your ton of Palios are great. It's just, I don't have room. So if you have room, try it out. Enjoy the deck. Hello, DK. This is the administrative staff of RedTube. We have noticed you haven't logged in for two weeks. We are just checking to see that everything is okay with one of our fans. Since you visited us last time, we've updated the redhead and blonde section with many videos we know you will enjoy. See you soon.
She has got all the colored wigs. I'm covered, boy. I don't need you. Thank you. Even though it wouldn't be that bad. Wouldn't be that bad. Let's just set up. This duel will decide. Well, within this duel, our next duel will decide if I will play uh, an Armades. Armades with a uh, wielder because of the Kanadias. And if I do that, I might put in Hallucigenias. Yeah. Yeah. Giant Koi. Hey, DK, I found this song and I thought it would be nice for those Monka S duels when you're commentating. Yeah, the Kevin. That Kevin song? Goddamn. Yeah, Kevin McLeod. That did sound like a song that he would uh, sell to like a movie. Volatile reaction. Thank you, Giant Koi. Cyberstyle! You can't do anything with that. You can't do anything with that! Dark Soul! Here comes the Hyunlei play. SJM. What was the name of the video slash anime with the girls dancing? What the? What the? We're gonna do Sangin. We're gonna set up later. We'll set up later. The Ayaya? You want Ayaya? To Ayaya, bro. Ayaya. You want just for research, right? Ayaya. No, I think he means the other one, that Grand, Grand Harrier. If you're here, he wants to know your video name. Ayaya. Grand Harrier, hook this boy up. Help him out. It was the, the two girls biting each other. Die! Sangin causes cards to miss the timing. If that was a U Bell, it would miss the timing. And Insectron is for cards to miss the timing too. On Insectron Summon, uh, Chainlink 2 will be Wielder. It's so important to know that information. Super Q. I want like a bigger Hyunlei. We, you know, we're setting up. We, we like to do follow-up plays. That's what I love about Synchroing and the TCG. You don't think about the immediate situation. You also prepare for a follow-up. And that's exactly what we did with this play. I will, if you can remind me after the stream, I'll dig through the logs. We'll find it. I will find it. I know all of you want to know what that face down card is. So we have to find out. The only way to find out is force him to use it or destroy it. X, 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 Saber, Hyun, Lei. Hyun Lei was one of my favorite synchros ever in the TCG. I topped so many regionals with her. I love her. What is it? Canadia. You fool! And I also used it with Trap Stun. That was so popular. That was my play. Trap Stun, yeet! Fool! If not, I'll help you if needed. Oh my Jesus! Was I supposed to show you this? Oh boy. Oh boy. Floodgate Trap Hole, boy. Flip that down. Swing and attack into Morella, setting up for that survival end. He's got double survival end in the graveyard now with the Morella on the field. God damn, if that's a third survival end face down, we are screwed. Unstoppable dino power, gain a hundred attack, takes out our serene psychic witch. That's right, that's a psychic wielder. Psychic wielder plus dark soul, you what mate. Sealed tombs, so you're not gonna be able to use your survival end anymore. I don't think so. I don't think so. Hyun Lei, destroy that back row and destroy your monster. Canadia, that must stop my psychic wielder from destroying that saber source, right? Because I, I'm considered to not have any attack now, right? 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 Wrong. The lower attack monster will still be destroyed even if I'm face down on resolution. What does Psychic Wielder do? You're about to see. Pay attention to the Saber Source. A regular Hyunlei Summon destroys all back row. But when summoned when, with Psychic Wielder, something will happen to that Saber Source. Bam! That's exactly what happened. Unstoppable Dino Power. He is under the effect of Sealed Tombs right now. It's all good. 
force it out, swing in. He's popping everything, popping two cards. For some reason, did not go for the Hyun Lei. I know why, though, because he's going for Salamandra. Salamandra will be bigger than my Hyun Lei. Took out both of my Kanadias. There you go. As you can see, the newly drawn card was the set card. He already had a Salamandra in his hand. Sally Mandra 2450, 2550, swings into an Econ, does not suicide. Thank you. Serene Psychic Witch will banish another Psychic Wielder. Psychic Wielder. I love Synchro Shokaning into Powered Insectron. Powered Insectron with Psychic Wielder is lovely. This card cannot be destroyed by battle or card effects, which is so good against Survival's End. They can't Survival End him. Nope. And we're destroying a monster on the field with our Psychic Wielder. Goodbye. Bad Aim. Bad Aim can destroy another card that is not the card activating. Full board clear. Dark Soul just keeps giving itself back. Gives me access to that Hyun Lei. Much needed Hyun Lei. Pop that back row, boy. Survival End. This is not good for us. It's going to use our Kanadia and his own Kanadia. That's going to be two months on the field. Pay attention to this turn. We have a Floodgate Trap Hole. Perfect time to Floodgate, right? Wrong. Do not Floodgate here. Banish. Destroy. Special. Flood it! Now we want a Floodgate. Now we want a Floodgate. And I want to summon my Kanadia off my own Floodgate. Take out the Salamandra. Who's winning now? Who is winning now? And I have a follow-up Psychic Wielder plus Dark Soul. This is a level 6 Synchro. How do we summon Psychic Wielder? Basically, this card says if you have a level 3 on your field, it doesn't have to only be a level 3. It could be a level 3 and something else. Just if you have a level 3, you could special summon Psychic Wielder. Synchro Shokan. It is a tuner. And then you destroy any monster with lower attack than your Synchroed monster. Now, I got a little excited here. I'm going to tell you that I don't think this was the correct play, but it was the more fun play. This is really risky, and I definitely acknowledge that even in the moment when I summoned it, but I so badly wanted to Hyunlay this fool, which we successfully do. I'm here to tell you the correct play at all times. Synchro! Shokan! Hyunlay! Pop that back row. Pop that booty. Stomped and stamped, you're finished. I think summoning Sangin would be much safer. So why was that un an unsafe play? If he if he did have a Kanadia, he could have Kanadied my Psychic Wielder, and then my Dark Soul is left face up. Then all he has to do is top deck a monster. Where if we have a Sangin plus our uh, Kanadia, that is lethal on its own. If he were to flip down our tuner, and then we summon the tuner in defense anyway, so we'd be safe. God damn. Need any monster. Come on. Come on. Besides a wielder. Besides a wielder. Any monster. Besides a wielder. Besides a wielder. What is this deck? This is a an X Saber deck. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Our rank up against Unga, 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 Bunga. Okay. Woo! 25! Damn, son. Damn, son. So, do I get that effect? Hmm. Hmm. Did not need all of this, but 